Happy spring, everybody. It's strawberry season. Hi, it's John for ProduceGeek.com, and May is one of my favorite months for picnic produce and spring produce. So I'm here to talk about three of my May favorites. California strawberries are in peak season, and it's a great time to get good value, tasty berries, and, you know, just enjoy them. California's in peak season, and check out these nice berries. These have, this particular one has great taste, mm, super sweet, ah, enjoy. I love berries. So here's what I do when I'm at the store. I'm looking at the entire clamshell. I'm making sure there's nothing wet on the bottom. And I just got my eye out for, you know, no, no dark or sunken spots. Green, green calyx on the top. If I see that, I buy them. And I try to use strawberries within two days because Yes, you may be able to have them in your fridge for a while, but chances are they're going to uh, dehydrate or go bad. So really, use your berries quickly. What else is in peak season for spring? Check out rhubarb. Rhubarb is this, uh, ve uh, it's a vegetable that sprouts up in the spring and grows these big leaves and you pull out the stalk and that's what's edible. The leaves not edible, but it's this crisp, red skin stalk that has a like a greenish white flesh and it's a really bitter uh, vegetable it's like it's crisp like celery but it's got like a a bitter uh, flavor that is just accentuated by sugar and the bitterness mellows when you cook it and so what do you do with rhubarb? Well, typically you turn this stalk into a dessert. Rhubarb crisp, rhubarb crumble, rhubarb sauce, rhubarb compote. And uh, so I would at home chop this down into pieces a little smaller than this, simmer it off with some sugar, maybe a teaspoon of uh, uh, quick tapioca mix and turn that into a sauce that I could put over pound cake. I could put over ice cream. I could put stir into my Greek yogurt. Wow, I love rhubarb. And what pairs better with rhubarb than strawberries? Not much. Strawberries and rhubarb go great in desserts. We've got a really easy rhubarb sauce recipe. Click on the link below. And what's the last thing that I wanted to talk about this morning? It's these flat saucer shaped onions. May is all about Vidalia onions. In and around Vidalia County, Georgia, is this area around in Vidalia County and around it, is the soil that's just perfect for growing low pungency onions, meaning that that, that uh, pungency that gets in your nose with an onion, that's low, the sugars are high, and they grow in this flat shape. Wow, this is a great onion for cooking, for grilling, for sauteing. And this is one of the most famous varieties of sweet onion in peak season, May and June and into July. So Vidalia's. I'm going to grill uh, with these for the next two or three months. I'm also going to cut these raw for salads and sandwiches, homemade hoagies. Mm. This is a fresh onion meaning uh, it's been dug and now it's available for sale right away. It's not cured, so the skin has not set and become hard. And so you wanna use these, you don't refrigerate onions, just keep it out at room temperature, but use these within a week. Mmm, what great flavor. Mmm, I can't wait to grill or put that in a sandwich. And for what's best right now, head over to our social media pages, share this with a friend. Happy May, everybody.